This section is dedicated to all of the elements of beagle digging problems. And while it would seem strange to non-beagle owners, we will not only discuss outdoor digging, but indoor digging as well. So, whether your beagle tries to dig his way under the fence in the yard to escape, digging a legion of holes in your outdoor space or digs at the carpets inside your home, we have all of the information and helpful tips that you will need for both young beagle puppies and older dogs that just love to dig. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique, guide is in the description below. Why Beagles Dig? With behaviors being a canine instinct or a learned behavior, owners should know digging in general as a deep-rooted canine instinct. Reasons for instinctual digging include hiding, stowing food, a nesting instinct which can be display both inside and outside and prey chase activity. With this said, a beagle puppy or dog may dig for reasons other than those that come from these normal canine predispositions. Outdoor digging. Let's first take a look at the reasons why a beagle will dig when outside. Many owners will have a run in the backyard and this in and of itself is a good element for this breed. Problems can arise when a beagle puppy or dog is left to his own devices and has enough unsupervised time to dig holes. The top 5 reasons a beagle will dig holes and how to stop digging. 1. Temperature. When the temperature rises and the sun is shining bright, many beagles will instinctively dig into the soil in an effort to create a cooler, more comfortable resting spot. Most beagles that do this will not have access to enough shade and be either on a run or in an enclosed fenced-in yard without enough tree shading. 2. Burying Treats. It's amazing how a beagle is able to hide a treat, bury it and then dig it up again all done with an owner wondering where that treat came from in the first place. But at the same time it can make your yard look like a minefield. A beagle can have quite an amazing knack for quickly hiding a treat for future use. 3. Hunting Behavior. Tracking after small critters is most certainly a beagle trait. Digging problems can arise when those creatures are underground. Many owners have been shocked to find out that their beagle that dug up the yard had actually tracked and discovered moles in their many tunneling holes. 4. Escaping, fence perimeter digging. For all beagles in general, being outside means being bombarded with an overwhelming volley of scents and sounds that trigger the need to investigate. For beagles that are suffering from separation anxiety, it is best to create an indoor area for them and to reserve outside time to the times that will be supervised by you, daily walks and play time, exercise outdoors. If owners find that they need their beagle confined to a certain area in the house this can easily be done with a nice indoor playpen or gating that keep a beagle in one area that can be filled with all sorts of toys, a nice comfy bed to rest, food and water. 5. Boredom. Last but not least, Beagle will dig holes in the yard simply because they don't have anything else to do. Another option is to offer a raw, meaty bone. Not only can this provide stimulation and prevent boredom, it is also good for dental hygiene since chewing on this type of bone breaks off tartar and can be the equivalent to a thorough brushing. With many Beagle puppies and dogs, it only takes one to three days to become very attached to the selected area. Once you reach this point, Freely allow your dog to bring a treat from the house to his area in order to bury it. This will reinforce the idea of digging and burying only there. What does not work? In an effort to stop a beagle from digging, some owners will try just about anything. There are two offers of solution that we do not recommend. The first is to bury the dog's feces in the area in which you do not wish for him to dig. This usually does not work, since a dog will lay claim to an area that is used for urination and bowel movements. Therefore, this is counterproductive. Additionally, even if it does deter a beagle from digging in that one spot, he will most likely simply move over a foot and dig there, which does not remedy the foundation of the problem. The other huge no-no is to burying a balloon. The idea behind this solution is that burying a half-filled balloon and allowing a beagle to uncover it, will lead to the dog's nails popping it, the noise scares the bejesus out of the dog and he will not want to dig anymore. 
what can we say, other than it is quite terrible to try and scare a dog to stop any behavior and if a beagle is digging due to anxiety, scaring him is just awful and will only add to his misery. Simply no. Indoor digging. Other beagles will softly, dig, at blankets and other elements to, hide, toys or to create an area to rest and or sleep and as long as this does not involve the destruction of any bedding or other objects, there is no reason to deter this behavior. To ward off this behavior and stop the destruction of carpeting and flooring, using an apple bitter spray on areas that a puppy or dog tends to dig at can be very helpful in addition to distraction techniques. If this is a moderate to severe issue, it may be necessary to gate off certain areas of the house. For puppies, digging and often chewing at carpeting stems from teething issues, which can be very intense for some pups. Often, the saying holds true that a well-exercised dog is a well-behaved dog. While we all have busy schedules and your beagle may not even appear to want to go for a walk, setting aside a bit of time each day for a brisk walk around the neighborhood can be quite helpful in allowing a puppy or dog to release pent-up energy and tire himself out a bit. In addition, walking keeps the body strong, promotes good health and allows a dog to learn socialization skills and healing commands along the way. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.